up beauties, it's Lindsay. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about this gorgeous hair that you guys have seen on Snapchat. You saw it on Instagram if you saw my Sigma pictures and Twitter too. It's also the hair I'm wearing in my Abbey for all social media. So it's this hair right here which is from Chalk Hair. Chalk Hair is kind of like a little sister company slash branch off of uni wigs which I'm sure you guys have heard of. I've also reviewed uni wigs. How loyal are you? Okay, um, yeah, I've reviewed them as well. So this is like their new little side company called Chalk Hair. The unit you see me wearing is, was 18 inches. Um, it's a brown ombre shade and I did get a petite cap size. If you guys have been rocking with me for a minute, you knew I was like going through this, all these cap sizes are too big moment. I realized I was like ordering normal or like regular size caps and that's why they were too big. My head is smaller than I thought it was. So if you're having that problem, get a petite cap size and then you'll realize, oh, I do have a little hit. We'll get more into the hair in a second, but first I do want to talk about the shipping. Now I will say this is probably my favorite hair that I own, my favorite wig ever, but this shipping took so dang long and I was going to be pissed if I hated the hair. Thankfully I love it, I'm in love with it. But the shipping took about a little over a month. So if you need your hair like for the weekend or like in two weeks, you're not gonna get it in time. I give it like a month and a half in advance to be safe to get your hair because it really was. I kept emailing her and the customer service is super, super sweet, but I was like, um, we got an update, like have we shipped yet? So it did take a really long time, but I'm glad I do like the hair. We don't have any problems. So the hair did come in this uni wigs box. I'm not sure if they're gonna start making like a chalk wigs packaging. They are a very, very new company. So um, it did come in the uni wigs box. They may keep it like that or they might switch it up. I'm not sure. You get the hair obviously, and then they gave me two wig caps. I'm not sure if they just threw an extra one in there or you will get two wig caps as well. Um, a black one and a tan one. As you guys know, not a fan of wig caps, so we're not wearing those. You also get a brush. They're the ones that like the bristles are loops. I guess that's better for the hair because it doesn't tug on the wig. I just use my normal paddle brush and we don't have any problems with that. The hair did come nicely packaged in a net and when I first took it out, I was like, girl, we are serving J-Lo meets Destiny's Child Beyonce, like I was feeling it. I was here for it, I loved the coloring, I loved everything. I took the lace off, the hairline was iconic, but I will say I cut a little too close um, when I was cutting off the lace, so when I started brushing out the hair, it was shedding a ton. So I got really nervous. I was like, oh, this is gonna be a shedder. We've got a shedder on our hands, friends. But I have brushed the hair again since, and it does not shed. So just make sure you're being careful when you cut the lace, because if you cut a little bit too much, it's gonna start shedding a little bit. As I've said in previous hair videos, you guys know I get longer hair from all hair companies um, because I just don't trust anybody's ends. I just always feel like their ends are not gonna meet my expectations. So I'll always get them longer and trim it to how I want it. If I want it to look a little more blunt, a little more natural, whatever. If I wanna cut some layers in it. Um, but I really did not cut a lot off of here. It was a little thin on the ends. I cut that bit off a little bit, but I didn't layer it or anything. I did add a few curls. Um, just to make it a little wavy, you know? If you know me or if you are a hair guru yourself, you know a lot of hair companies that factory smell and you're just not with it. This hair does not have a smell. If anything, it smells like more clean. And I think if I remember correctly, uni wigs, like the other wig I reviewed was like that too, didn't have a weird smell. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. But um, yeah, the chalk hair, this unit did not have a weird smell. So I was so thankful for that. You could just wear it right out the box. And this side of the highlights or the ombre, it's not really ombre, it is more highlights, um, is different than this side. But it's not too crazy to the point where I hate the hair so much. But I will say it is a little streaky on this side, but it's okay. Let's talk about this cap construction though. Hold on, I am shooketh. We've got two combs on the front side. There's no middle comb up front, which everyone hates that middle comb that uh, wigs will put on there sometimes. So there's no middle comb. There is one in the back though. We've got adjustable straps that are sturdy, hallelujah, because you know when they pop off, girl, that is no good. And another cool addition, I've never seen this in wig house before, are the two clips on the side. These are like the little, um, hair extension, clip and extension clips. So that's great because I normally just use bobby pins to secure my wig down, but these clips help secure it down even 
better. The hair is a silky straight texture and I just added a few little bumps and curls in it, but it does curl very, very well, just like any other human hair wig. It is honestly my favorite wig that I have right now because the cap construction is amazing. The hair color itself is amazing. I'm loving what it's doing for the skin tone, girl. Um, I just, I don't know, I love the hair. I really didn't have to mess with it a lot and it's just, it smells good. I didn't have any problems with that. I think the only thing was that it took a year and a half to get to me. No, it took about a month to get to me. So it does take a while, but I personally think it was worth the wait. So that is all for this review. If you guys have any other questions, please let me know in the comment section. I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Um, check the description box. I'll have more details about this hair, things I already said, things I probably missed that I'll realize while editing this video. To my LA subbies or anybody else flying in for the next Face Awards on the 19th, I'm gonna be there. If you're gonna be there, let me know in the comment section below because I will be vlogging. I wanna make sure if you guys are there, you're in the vlog as well because I just, I don't know, I love that. Let's take selfies, let's like create cool handshakes and stuff. Is that old? Do people still do handshakes? I don't know. But if you're gonna be there, let me know in the comment section below. So that is all for this review. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to check out Chalk Hair and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.